Atlanta game. Joshua Dobbs already has a, a safety against him and a fumble turnover. Here he goes to K.J. Osborne, who gets sandwiched in between defenders, and immediately you can see concern by all the players right in the middle of the field. Immediately, Minnesota players waving. We'll show you one replay of it uh, where Joshua Dobbs goes down to a knee immediately. Immediately, uh, the game comes to a stop. Osborne sandwiched in between. All right, we're, we're going to make the decision to not show you the replay here of K.J. Osborne, who was... Uh, K.J. Osborne, eyes open. They're bringing out the cart after that catch and then hit across the middle. An update on the penalty flag, hoping that he's okay health-wise. Dean Blandino... As D. Alford, part of that with Jeff Okuda delivering the hit. And Dean, the call, they made it during the break. The defenseless player. Fans, by the way, applauding as he's up on his feet and standing. And that's an encouraging sign. Movement to get to the cart. Go to our rules analyst, Justin Jefferson, over to give him a hug. Dean, how about the penalty? No question. Osborne's in a defenseless posture. He's trying to make the catch. Alfred comes in, lowers his head, makes forcible contact. Akuda really was the second player, but the foul was called on Alfred. And, uh, and you can see that forcible contact right to the head neck area. Now, New York could get involved in a possible disqualification. I don't know if that's the case. We probably would have heard something by now. But no question, that's a foul. And uh, it's just great to see Osborne up and, uh, and doing well here. All right, thank you, Dean. Yes. Osborne ruled a catch. The 15-yard penalty will be tacked on it. It certainly looked very serious, but that's always a good sign. That is a good sign. Very encouraging. And I mean, I don't care what level of football you play, and you got to be tough to play this game. And uh, glad to see he's okay. Glad to see he got off the field under his own power. The thumbs up. But one thing the NFL has done that's changed a lot over the years, as we've all witnessed, is they have really, you know, taken the head trauma and the head injuries uh, very seriously, and they're doing the best they can because it's a vicious game. There's no question about that. But the best they can. To, to protect these players as much as they can. So good to see them precautionary taking him off the field. Good to see him.